Oi! Can I help? What do you think you're playing at spreading rumours about our Lydia? No one's spreading rumours. If you're on about the facts I might have been reporting, that's a different matter. And what facts are they then, Miss Marple? I was here when the police came. Just because the police asked her some questions, that doesn't mean that she's actually done anything wrong. No smoke without fire, that's all I'm saying. I was only repeating what I heard. <sighs> what you wanted to hear more like. You want to be careful what you say about others. Because you, more than anyone, know how important reputation is. What does that mean? Hmm. This dump. A few bad reviews. You'd be ruined. You've got no right coming in here threatening me like that. Oh, and you think by selling me my rights that's going to stop me from having the satisfaction of seeing this place go down Swanley? I don't think so. The copper was going on about some bogus pension scheme. What conclusion do you expect people to make? None, when you've got no facts. It's not like I'll be the only one wondering. People talk, you can't stop them. Just because troubles are known for you lot don't mean it is for everyone else. Oh, I get it. <laughs> You're just buzzing because no one's pointing the finger at you and Jimmy for a change. Leave me and Jimmy out of this. Why should I? Come on, let's face it. Your marriage is a car crash. My marriage is none of your business. Paul's not here because of Jimmy, and we have been nothing but good about that. The issue is, what is wrong with you? OK, Mandy, I've got the message. There's no need to turn this nasty, all right? Well, you should have thought of that before you started gobbing off about our Lydia. You leave her alone. Do you understand me? <laughs> <laughs>